I'm Caleb Dennison, and welcome to DT Daily. Coming up, a power-free fridge could help feed the world, Cora gets Tron 3 back on track, and 3D printing takes the fashion world by storm. Here in the first world, if you want to keep something cold, you put it in the fridge. It's just what you do. But what if you don't have a fridge or electricity, as is the case for billions of people? Sadly, a lot of food goes to waste. But that may change with the Evaptainer, a small fridge of sorts that doesn't use any electricity. The tech involved is actually ancient. It's based on Xeropods, which use evaporation to keep things cool. It's estimated that nearly half the produce harvested in Africa spoils before it gets to market. Evaptainer's developers think their device could cut that number in half. Evaptainer should cost 20 bucks at the most, putting them well within reach of those who need them the most. One of the first science fiction films to use CGI was Disney's groundbreaking Tron in 1982. It only took Disney 28 years to serve up the sequel, Tron Legacy, and now just five years later, it looks like Tron 3 is finally on the way. According to a post on a Vancouver, BC website, shooting will begin in October, and Olivia Wilde, who played Program Made Real Cora, is reportedly on board. While both Tron movies were not loved much by critics, sci-fi fans flocked to them for their high-tech storylines and amazing visuals. Expect no less from the next installment, and we can only hope Daft Punk also returns for the soundtrack. We keep hearing about the 3D printing revolution, and it is happening, but mostly in garages and next to the DT kitchen. But one place it's really taking off is the fashion world. Check out these images from a recent fashion show in New York that featured a lot of fantastical 3D creations. That's an amazing hat right there. Check those shoes and va va voom, we dig that 3D printed dress for sure. Another major player getting into the 3D game is Nike. They're putting printers to work making lightweight cleats, bags, and other athletic gear that not only works great, it looks totally trick as well. Less Extreme items are becoming available, like these shoes, and you'll probably eventually be able to print them at home to your exact size. Now that would be a revolution. And that's DT Daily for today. We'll be back tomorrow.